Hey guys, so today I'm going to be showing you how to get this look here. Um, it has a nice little sparkly eye and nice little lip. All these things are featured in my haul video that will be coming soon this month. And this video is also a collab video with Sam I Am. Like the way you say it, I think that's how you say it. That's how you, it, that's how you read it, but I don't know if that's how you say it, you know? It looked like Sam I Am, like... It don't look like Sam I Am, but it's pronounced like Sam I Am. You know what? I'm just put her name here, and I'm going to leave the link to her channel below. And if you guys are from her channel, thanks for checking me out. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure that you like, comment, and subscribe. And if you're already subscribed, make sure that you like and comment. And yeah, so if you really like this look and you want to So the do palette it, I'm going to be using today is the Eyes on the 60s palette from BH Cosmetics. The first color I'm going to go into is this purple color here. And I'm just gonna go in with this deep crease brush from BH Cosmetics. Looks like that. No, no, no. Then going to go into that same palette into this lavender color here. And I'm just gonna put that on the inner part of my crease. And just blend that kind of together. And I already had primed my lips and my lids and set them. And then I'm just going to go in with the regular crease brush. Crease brush that I use to put the transition color. And I already put the transition color after I put my setting powder. And for my transition color, I just use something close to my skin tone, which is Saddle by MAC. So if you want, you can use Saddle by MAC even if you're not my skin tone, but you just want to use something to for a good transition. And then you're going to go back in with that purple just to darken that up a little bit. The dark purple. And I don't want to use tape because I want to really blend it out. And I don't really want it to be like a precision, uh, <laughs> a straight line, <laughs> basically, because we're not gonna do any eyeliner or anything. So we just want to make sure we blend everything together. Then to deepen this crease, I'm going to go in the same palette and take this black right here. I'm just gonna put that in directly into the crease. You wanna make sure you get all the excess off because black is very, you know, pigmented. -pig. And you just wanna go right into that crease. Just like this. And again, you wanna blend that out. And go back into that purple so you can make sure that you have some purple in there and this time you want to put it a little above the crease go into that lavender color again put that in the front and then you're just gonna blend this all in together and 
if you have another way of how you want to do this but use same colors you can but i just want that crease to be really deep for the look i'm going for because you see we're going to put glitter on the lid so i'm going to take some of this that's it for this palette right now i'm going to take some of this elf glitter primer and then i'm going to take this glitter called lynx lavender from box glitter slash glitter my world that i did a haul on um i'm not sure i think you guys will be seeing it soon and i'm just gonna take this brush from bh cosmetics just a flat um eyeshadow brush take some of that glue and put it on my lid You could put it wherever you like on your lid. If you want to make it go up more, down more, you know. If you want to go more into the cor your corner, you could do that. But I'm not going to do that for this look. You could also use this for springtime if you want. But this is more towards summer for me because this bright glitter color in the lip that I'm going to pair with. Then you're going to go into that glitter, put some on your brush, and place it right on your lid. Just like that. I'm just making sure that it's the same. Then you want to, cause I'm not using any liner. I think it looks better without liner. I'm going to tight line though with just a regular black um, eyeliner pencil from the hair store. I think it was by NK or something, like everything ripped off. This is old. And then you're just going to apply your falsies, which I'm going to do off camera. So now that I am baking and everything like that, we're going to go back to that lower lash line using the same brush here. Going back into that palette, I want to go wait after. So you're going to take this purple liner and go into the crease I mean not the crease you know what this is the lash line go back into that palette take that purple color the dark purple smoke off that lash line All that powder, all that setting powder. I'm going to use this color out of my MAC little palette thing that I made. Um, I'm not sure it's called. It's like pink something. And I'm just going to take a little bit of this. My blush. Or like this. I don't know. Whatever much you like to put there, you put it there. I'm not, I'm not a blush person. It might look harsh on the video. I don't know. Don't know. Don't care. It's a summary. That looks harsh. I'm trying to figure out. I'm just gonna blend it. This is my blush brush from Elf. It's not really too much. It looks fine to me. In person, it looks fine. 
I'm breaking out too. Okay, that's enough. Then I'm gonna go and go to the project by Mac. It did fall off, but I have it like somewhere in a little bag. So it's some more product in there. But I'm gonna take a sand brush. gold color and put that in the corner of my eyes because it does look a little empty right there This is my first time trying these, so I don't know if it's gonna be cute or ugly. Oh god. This is okay. I need to clean it up. Hold on. This is dirty because it ain't even wet. It's like I'm just gonna. Ooh, messy. I should take some concealer. But I'm not. So yeah, guys. This is the completed look. I'm just gonna take some Fix Plus. Spray it. I don't know how I feel about it. I mean, so I'm this is so the completed look. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Leave some feedback. Um, if you wanna see more summer looks, let me know. This was just a like, I'm just gonna do it and see how it turned out kind of thing like I did do one eye and I did not finish the eye so that's why I had no idea what colors it looked there I mean from far away it looks good but I don't really like it close up tell me how you feel about this pink lip on me because I never wear pink lips really I'm just like so afraid but I think I like it after just like six for a minute it's kind of cute so yeah 